Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing this makeup look here. It's really simple. It's my everyday natural makeup look when I'm going to work, when I'm running errands, doing anything like that. Um, I hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching. Bye. Okay, let's get started. First, I'm going to be applying my It Cosmetics CC Cream in the color Medium. I'm just going to be putting a little bit on my hand here, and I'm going to be applying it with a damp beauty blender. It's important to make sure you do have a damp beauty blender just because if you don't, it will rub all over your foundation around. I put mine under the sink for just a few seconds and then I squeeze it about 10 times till it reaches its maximum size. Then I make sure to use a clean towel and I blot all the excess water out. After I apply that all over my face, I'm going to be using the IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Waterproof Concealer in the color Neutral Medium. I love this stuff because I really struggle with dark circles, so it just gives me a really good highlight color underneath my eyes. It lasts all day. I even apply some to the bridge of my nose, on my forehead, on my chin, and I love it. You guys should really check it out. I purchased all of my IT Cosmetics products at Ulta, and I'll list everything in the bottom bar for you guys. So once I am done applying all of my concealer, I'm going to use the IT Cosmetics Jumbo Heavenly Powder Brush to apply my Mineral Fusion Press Powder in the color Olive. I love this brush, guys. It, it feels like heaven. It's amazing. I just want to keep rubbing it on my face. I love it. After that, I'm just going to brush out my eyebrows because they're looking a little cray cray. And the next mandatory step that you do not want to miss is having a little dance party with yourself in your room, all alone, by yourself. I have no idea what song I was listening to, but I was getting really into it. Back to the eyebrows. I will be using two of the eyeshadow colors from the Too Faced Natural Eye Palette. First I'm just going to dab a little bit of the color Cashmere Bunny onto my brush, and then I think it's called Sexpresso. I'm going to start at the base of my eyebrow and move forward. That way you'll get the most natural looking eyebrows. After I do those eyebrows, I'm going to be using only two colors from the Naked palette. The first color I'm going to sweep all over is called Virgin. I'm just going to put that all over my eyelid. And guys, I really just think it's impossible for me to keep my mouth closed while I'm doing my makeup. I have a problem. Next, I'll be using the color Buck to put in my crease. I'm just going to apply that with the same brush. I'm not going to do anything crazy today. Okay, now to the fun part. We are going to be using the IT Cosmetics CC Radiance Bronzer first. I'm just going to be doing bronzing, not any crazy contouring. I'm going to make sure to get my forehead, my chin, my neck, just so I don't look discolored. I also love to use the Mineral Fusion Bronzo, Bronzo? <laughs> Bronzer Duo in the color Luster. I just like to warm up my face a little bit more than the IT Cosmetics Bronzer did for me. Then I'm going to use the Velvet Luxe Express Fan Brush just to blend out my bronzer and my blush. If you guys ever find yourselves in Ulta, make sure to stop by the IT Cosmetics counter to check out their brushes. Guys, they are awesome. I just curled my lashes and now I'm using the Fiber Wig Mascara. This stuff is also to die for because you don't have to use any eye makeup remover. It just comes off with soap, soap and water. And last but not least, I'm going to finish off my look with this Maybelline Lip Gloss in Pop of Color. And 
and by this point I haven't washed my hair for a few days so I just decided to throw it up into a low bun. This is my favorite messy hair look because it's just easy and simple and you can do it when your hair is dirty and you still look cute and classy. Alright guys, so we're all finished with this makeup look. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye!